Let's simplify the fraction 16 over 20. And here's what we'll do. We want to find another fraction that's equal to 16 over 20, but it's in lowest terms. So to do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into 16 and 20. So here are the factors of 16 and 20. So we have 16 and then the factors for 20. And we want to find the greatest common factor. So it looks like the greatest factor that goes into both 16 and 20, that's going to be 4. So we'll divide 16 by 4 and 20 by 4, and we'll have simplified 16 over 20. Let's move these over here. 16 divided by 4, that's just 4. And then 20 divided by 4, that's 5. So we've simplified 16 over 20 down to 4 over 5, and we can't simplify this any further. If you divide 16 by 20 and 4 by 5, you'll get the same answer. 0.8. These are equivalent fractions. It's just we've reduced 16 over 20 down to its lowest terms, 4 over 5. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.